So over the break, Castile broke out into a civil war. Unfortunately, we were in Regency Council, not anymore, but they, for the most part, got a grip over what was going on. But there is still a 21 stack here that Castile has to do something about but I don't know if they are. Uh, now, over the break, I did manage to get up both of my exploration. Well, first of all, I got the exploration idea group, then I got two, uh, I, what are these things called? Policies, ideas, uh, over the break. So I can now begin to explore. Let's go ahead and do that. I also am gonna have a rebel uprising here in the Moroccan province. Um, that's fine, we'll just kind of keep an eye out for that. But let's find our fleet and let's assign them to uh, start exploring. We probably should have done that earlier. We probably should have had this stuff explored. Oh, look at that. They're not going to win that. I have definitely been considering building a, uh, a spy network against Castile. But I've been watching them in the ledger, and they haven't been doing that bad. They've been holding on to about 5,000 manpower. They're at 1,500 men. Thing is, obviously, I'm not going to be able to get England involved, even if I were to go to war with... Uh, even if, and then I have to break my alliance too, and it's not all a guarantee. Like, if, if someone big were to declare war on them, like France, which is not going to happen, but if France were to declare war on them, then I'd probably think about it or jump in, but right now it's still out of the question in my mind, but uh, but we'll see. Uh, and yeah, like I said, we're going to have a, an uprising here, but we'll, we'll hopefully take care of it. And I have been to, uh, I've been beginning to colonize my first province. Bam! So, uh, yeah, I decided to, over the break, that we were going to be more of a kind of a peaceful colonizer as Portugal. I don't really want, I don't think I'm going to have the biggest military in the world, so I really think that native coexist policy uh, is the best route to go. Uh, because I'm not necessarily going to be able to fight back um, all the time when it comes to when rebels uprise. I guess when natives um, uprise and stuff like that. So, yeah, hopefully this helps without you know decreasing my chance of uprising to negative 100%. Uh, we are getting there in terms of establishing this as a colony. Of course, I'd like to go after. I forgot what these islands are called. Technically, we don't. We haven't discovered them yet. These those are not the Canaries. These are the Canaries. Uh, I I need to look at that. We'll we'll explore that right now actually. But uh, anyways, so let me give you... Oh, we have to hire... That's right, we have to hire one first. Okay, so uh, bam. It's going to cost me 50 diplomatic power, which I don't have just yet. Okay, so let me give it like two or three months. Uh, I'm doing diplomatic power like at... Ooh, and Castile lost that. See, someone needs to jump into war. Aragon or somebody. See, maybe if Aragon... We're not friendly. Well, Aragon... It doesn't matter because Aragon wouldn't let me, I don't think. Maybe I should try to get up an alliance with Aragon, though. Maybe that's not a bad idea. Okay, so what is this? Clergy estate wants 15 loyalty... Gain 10 influence until 1479, or missionary strength, which actually, I don't, that doesn't really matter. Yeah, I'd rather just go after this. Um, the clergy is at 50%. Yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and grab this. Bam. So now we're getting 15% tax, uh, national tax modifier. Stability cost is going down by 7.5%. 7 .5%, and then we have uh, yearly papal influence up too. Oh yeah, that's right. What's going on, what's going on with the papacy? I don't have anything that I can pay for still. It's all going to cost about 50. Current controller is uh, France. Why did this stuff get so expensive? This was not that expensive last time. Anyways, uh, gain of stability. Oh, I like that. Reformation desire. I don't want to be Protestant. I don't think I do. Because usually Castile, usually Iberia doesn't become Protestant, but I, I don't know yet. We'll see, but I, I would rather get uh, 20 Papal Influence instead. That way we can go after something soon, I'm thinking. Uh, truce is expired with Tunis. Okay. That's nice. That's nice to know. I don't even know what I'm going to get here, but uh, I'll get something. Oh yeah, when is this? Is this uprising going to happen or what's going on? Well, it's going to stop now because we're over the province. Dang, that's a big old rebellion, but somebody needs to fight them. And right now, it can't be just me. Uh, they tell us the end of the Castilian Civil War. Yeah. Well, that's too bad. So they gave into the Noble Rebels, and then that's that's it. All right, Agent. Okay, so we are... Uh, oh! The following allies is no longer considered your alliance worth keeping, and will end it soon. Alliance breaking. The following allies no longer considers your alliance worth keeping, and will end it soon. You may be able to make them reconsider by improving relations and... Oh, well, yeah, that's not good. Well, because I, I decided not to support them. I didn't want to give them 2,000 manpower because I wanted to see what they would do. There was a mission that popped up. I could support Castile or I didn't, or I, I could have not. I decided not to support it. That might have been a mistake, but I've got free diplomats that aren't really doing anything right now. So I will try to improve our relationship. 
Yeah, I should be able to improve it quite high, almost to 200%. I don't know if that's going to help. Removing provinces of vital interest or breaking alliances with their rival. By improving relations, removing province of vital interest, uh, interest or uh, breaking alliances with their rival. I'm just going to try to improve relations. I think that's for the best right now. I mean, maybe you're mad because I have my own... Oops. Interests? I don't know. Am I only ally rival to... Oh, bam, doesn't matter. And there it goes. So, do you hate me or what? You don't technically hate me, not yet at least. Castile's opinion is at 77. It doesn't technically say why, though. Is it just... Is that automatic, though? Like, if I don't take... I think that might just happen automatically if I don't take that event. Okay, well, anyways, I need to just worry about exploring for now. So, bam, I'm going to get my explorer up. We're going to start to figure out what the heck is going on in the world. It's not a very good explorer, but usually their pips aren't as high as, like, an admiral or something. So, no big surprise. Okay, so explorer ready. Uh, what are we going to explore? We've got a lot of things. Um, let's explore the care. Uh, we want to go South America. Yeah, let's go South America first. Africa need, could could wait. Africa can wait for a little bit. Aragon's declared war on Navarra. Now, what does that mean? Is it, Now, there was two people that were protecting the independence of Navarra. Oh, not anymore. Oh, before it was Castile and France. Not anymore. France is not doing so well. They had to release Barry. And, uh, oh, Felipe. Okay, so who are you going to be? Uh, you are going to be Edward Norton. King Edward Norton. King Norton, that sounds kind of good. Again, I should probably look into the, if these actors are actually Portuguese or not. Maybe I should try to think of Portuguese actors. That'd probably be a good idea. I kind of want them to uprise, though. That way I can lower my army maintenance again. But I, I guess I'll just keep an eye on it. Uh, I could always kick this... I could always kick this guy. We don't need him. We technically don't he need him. Whoa! Look at Brittany. I didn't realize that Brittany had grabbed... You know, Brittany might not be a bad alliance, either. Could probably get it up, too. But who are they going to help me out against, really? They're not going to help me out ultimately against France. Navarre, is Navarre really beating Aragon right now? Are you that weak? Aragon, is that how bad it, it's, it's come? So when I establish this colony here, uh, I believe... Well, we need to actually explore more. Well, we're coming back right now. As soon as we establish this colony, though, we won't. it won't take as long. Okay, well, where else are we going to explore by? Let's... Uh, I'd like to explore, let's explore more of exploring Western African Sea. I guess we'll go someplace real close by. I, I, I Like I said, I, I don't really want to go towards like the North Atlantic or anything like that. It's not like I have a chance of getting up towards that region anyways. What's going on in uh, Europe right now? Anything interesting in Ireland? Desmond's doing pretty good. Uh, Denmark is in the middle of the war, uh, in the middle of a war, a very small war, but they're not really winning that. Is that a trade dispute? Is that one of those trade leagues? Uh, yes. What is this? Natural scientist. Great advisor of us has died. Great advisor has died. Is that the administrative advisor? It was. That's fine. I don't think I'm going to get you back up because my economy was suffering anyways. Uh, and I don't think I need legitimacy at the moment. Yeah, I do actually. Why did, why did I lose? When did I lose legitimacy? I don't remember that. Gain 20 prestige. Oh, well, that kind of changes my mind a little bit. We're losing the prestige at 1.81. It's hard to get legitimacy, though. Kind of hard. I'm going to get a more prestige. Uh, let's get the legitimacy, because I, I, it is a little bit harder. Well, luckily, I still have that royal marriage with, with Castile. So why not? Portugal and Castile consider the same 10 provinces to be of vital interest. That's why. So, ah, uh, but I want this for myself. That... That sucks. So I'm going to be kind of in a stick. I, I'm going to force into a situation where I might have to let, let's see, what do you want? You want these. Fine. You know what? I might change this for you. I mean, you want this. I might take this away. Okay. How about, how about this? Okay. How about that? Are we in a better situation now, Castile? Yes, we are. So now, okay, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get the alliance back up because I don't really want to start anything with Castile at the moment. 
but that might we might need to change that. Also, I mean, so are you down to go to war then or what? You're not technically down yet. Oh, you're really not. Oh, Castile's in debt. Does not owe, and then yeah. We don't owe us any favors. England's almost down to help us out, but not yet. So eventually they should start to lower. Religious unity is going to be kind of a difficult thing if we do start to continue to expand into Morocco. Have, are we done exploring? You were just ex supposed to explore. Oh, there you go. I was going to say you were just supposed to explore like Western Africa. That shouldn't have taken that long. Okay, well, anyways. Um, I guess we will go exploring Atlantic. I thought we already did that. Well, we should go after the Caribbean. Obviously, if we can get up a Caribbean colony, that would be good. It's very valuable lands. Hopefully we explore more on the inside. Now, we only have one colonist at the moment. This is going to take us a little bit longer. Um, yeah, we only have one colonist at the moment. Oh, I should probably get my... I should probably get to my army force limit a little bit higher. What is costing me so much? State maintenance? Uh, it might also be because my... Oh, my forts are mothballed. What are we spending on? Oh, well, we're rooting corruption out. Can I just not pay any of that? There we go. That's a little bit better. Your corruption is growing. So if I don't pay for it at all, then it's going to grow. Stability cost affects our current... Oh, I'm sorry. That's stability. Corruption changes by 0, 0.9. Okay, fine. I will raise this up to the bare minimum. That was probably the minimum that I had it before. So it looks like I'm not going to be able to lower that part. Fort maintenance, fleet maintenance, colonial maintenance is probably what's killing me. That's that's probably what's happening. Well, that's just gonna have to happen though, because I, I need to I need to explore. Oh, we've been raided. Well, that's gonna happen too. So some sailors are gonna continue to die. North North Africa is gonna be killing us with that. I could also change around my mission settings. I haven't explored that too much, but uh, yeah. Um, now we can probably go along the coast of West Africa, and I'll I'll do that. We'll do that now. I do have another idea group. Am I falling behind in diplomatic ideas? Well, what's the next one? Colonial range. Do I really need that? I think I can hit that from this range if I just have to establish the colony. I think. Um, effective distance, 235. Colonial range is at 160. I think if I establish there, or I could just go after this island. I wouldn't mind that either way. Yeah, I'm going to wait. Okay, sailors and ducats are going to be stolen away from me. I'm probably going to have to take out a loan. I think so. Uh, yeah, let's let's go with the diplomatic technology. Get naval force limit up. Local shipbuilding speed will be a little bit better too. So that's fine. That's that's what I'll, I'll plan on doing. Nobility uh, estates loses 10 influence until 1483. Is that what it is? Wow, Aragon is still not winning their war with Navarra. That is very shocking. Wouldn't, wasn't expecting something like that. Do we have new missions yet? Colonize Cape Verde. Um, where is Cape Verde? Verde? W what is, wait, what? Aren't we doing that? Well, maybe that's not what they're talking about. Cape Verde. Ah, okay. I don't think uh, Spain will be doing that, so I think I'll do it. I'll try. What do we get out of this? Settler chant. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's do that. I was going to go after that island anyways. So we'll do that since we have it all set out. Now the question is, should I... I should probably remove the colonists from there. It's going to take longer for this to be established, but that's probably fine. And then I will send you out this way. Bam, so we can just finish that mission immediately. Well, do I need to establish the colony, or do we just need to begin the colonization process? That's the thing. Either way, it'll help me finish the mission faster. So that's what I'll do. Ooh, okay. So we're gonna we're gonna have to have to fight two different rebellions. The loan has been taken out. But uh, let me just get rid of this notification. Yeah, I'll, I'll raise I'll raise the uh, the inf uh, I'm sorry the inflation a little bit. Where's inflation at anyways? I know I took some money before from Granada. It's not that bad. Ah, uh, this is what's going to cost me a lot, and we have to fight those rebellions. That's not good. So if I lower my uh, my fleet maintenance, how much does that affect my exploration? It doesn't. As long as I'm just exploring, I could technically lower these. 
lower these down by quite a bit. And uh, I'm probably going to have to kick this guy too because I don't think I can afford him anymore. I mean, I was doing 10. I'm now doing 9. That's still not that bad. But still, something needs to happen. Something a little bit more needs to happen. I could always rent out my armies. But uh, but then again, I can't. Well, Castile is in, 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 in... They're not in a war. I couldn't... I probably couldn't do that either. How much does this cost me? Colonial maintenance. 6.18... Jeez. Yeah, that's not good. And that's why that's hmm. oh we have a we have a new national okay, administrative technology. We get national tax modifier, that's good. Missionary strength by 0.5, Catholicism gain 0.1% reform. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that chance. Still don't want to definitely not gonna be paying for missionary maintenance. That for sure is not a good idea. Oh, I probably have enough points for the papacy, don't I? How much am I getting per month? Why is this I don't understand why I spend five to gain. I've got 49. Where does it say how much I'm getting per month, though? Right there. 0 0.07. Um, modified by 35% due to the papal state opinion of us. Oh, so it already is pretty high. Okay, well, let's get up our military technology. Uh, I can now get better units. I think I'll go defensive. I'll probably be playing mostly defensive as uh, as Portugal. So I'm going to get those defensive pips. I'm losing ferocity, which I guess the ferocity doesn't matter. I'm glad that I went for the, uh, the coexist policy, especially as we're going to have to deal with more and more of these rebels. It sucks because I'm going to leave... I'm gonna have to be. I'm gonna have to force to to be leave to leave this uh, this province. Whenever the Granada separatists rise up. Hmm. You've taken a loan out. I've taken another loan. Holy crap. I might have to increase my autonomy here because it's not like it's gonna be going any lower, and I believe that is because of a culture thing. Total mission. Oh, that's well. That's. And I can't convert this over. I think it's a culture thing. How much am I losing now? Still a lot. Well, I will need to look into... I, I might be able to pay for possibly more money somehow. I might be able to invest in that direction. Let me lower... Let's lower the speed a little bit. Uh, but anyways, guys, looks like I'm about to stop right there. I'll figure it out over the break. But uh, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.